Good morning and hello. Welcome back to you brand new video and annoying entrance alert. But anyway, good morning and just sat here with my coffee and so good and I thought I would do or like vlog a day in my life and actually this morning I've already been up at like five because I went to yoga with my friend so I will insert the clip now yo it is 6 a.m and I am off to yoga pray for Olivia because I feel like I might fall asleep on the mat <laughs> My matching hoodie friend with the jog. But she is eating a banana. <laughs> After yoga. Oh, she's oh. gone the other way. Oh, I'll meet you around here. <laughs> <laughs> Oops. Yeah, we're late. We're late. I always use this. Oh, I never oh, even think. I'm I'm not a shortcut. I love to go the long way around. Who knows? But now I am back with a coffee and actually kind of dreading looking in my cupboards because I'm pretty sure I ran out of breakfast food. So I'm going to have to walk to Waitrose and life. But yeah, anyway, welcome to a day in my life of a model, Instagrammer, vlogger, whatever you want to call me. I am anything. I've got a... What am I doing today? I'm doing things today, I'm pretty sure. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. I'm going to a gig this evening with my friend, which will be fun. I'm super excited about it. It's actually for work, but it's still a gig and it's still cool. So we'll leave it like not till like 7.30 in the evening. And then I've got to go to Elite Models to pick up some clothes for a shoot for Nasty Girl, which I have to do during the day. So I'll head there like 11 and then shoot some photos after that for Brandy Melville and you know what you don't even care you just want to watch the freaking video so welcome to a day in my life a pretty standard day in my life this is how it goes pretty much every day so guys welcome to my world and cheers oh hello world so yeah as predicted obviously we are taking a rather early morning trip to the supermarket you know i'm not mad about it you know maybe it's do me good to get some more fresh air even though i've already been to yoga this morning but you know suck it up deal with it go get your freaking porridge olivia also i hope you appreciate my really rather fetching outfit it's high roll track suits 24 7 apart from when i have to shoot yes it's the cereal aisle breakfast before i can function properly as as human blah. see i can't even freaking speak before i can function properly as a human i need to get my porridge inside me hmm okay let's try this okay i have a peppermint one which rookie error but because i'm an absolute wuss i'm gonna add it to my porridge It says add three to five, but like I just said, I'm a wuss. So that green powder is um, matcha. Having some of this with my porridge because I found it in the supermarket the other day and it looks so freaking cool. I'm so excited. Look at it. It's like peanut butter and jelly in one because that's how lazy I am. Hello. So I've now changed 
and basically pretending to be an adult just by putting a blazer on but really I'm a fraud because I'm still in jeans. I am now off to Elite Models in central London. Oh wait did I tell you what I forgot to tell you what the gig was it's uh who's eating grandma I don't know if you've heard of them uh yeah it's who's this is what's in my box so it's who's eating grandma which i will confess i hadn't heard of but i'm pretty stoked because i listened to them and i literally love gigs so i'm kind of excited um but yeah i need to get my life together before all of that because first things first though the most glamorous tour of the day putting my bins out so love that truly an adult here of my meeting at Elite or the photo shoot but sometimes I just feel a little bit awkward when I'm working and like on a shoot but we had a nice lunch the shoot went really well for Nasty Girl which was fun sorry again I didn't film very much apart from like a few little clips off my feet because who doesn't love some feet but that's all done now guys I am at the absolute dreaded my least favorite place in the whole entire earth I literally dread when I have to go and step foot into this place it is Westfields I actually hate it it's like like hell going in there like I swear it's like such a depressing place but anyway I am at Westfields because as I said I have to yeah, I am a kid and walking along, yeah, but as I said, I have to pick up my fit for this evening for the gig, so popping into Bershka, pick all that jazz up. <laughs> Love this pasty stuff. Guys, help me out. I wish you could literally like real time help me, but Does neon suit me? Can I wear neon? What's your skirt? I never wear a skirt. <sighs> do I go comfort zone chilled outfit or do I go skirt a bit out there? Stay tuned later to the vlog to see which outfit I pick because actually I've just spied some pink cargo trousers, which now I'm like, that's a bit of a vibe. As promised, let's do a little clothing haul. So I did go a bit crazy at Bershka, but it's my job. So you can let me, ah. Oh. 
Um, but yeah, so I got a lovely silk satin, whatever you want to call it, skirt. But then I was having major identity crisis and I didn't know if I wanted black or purple because purple's a bit more out there, black's a bit more safe and I can't decide which mood I am in yet. So yeah, I got both and my thoughts were that I could possibly wear the lilac skirt with this very neon sweater which i really like the idea of but again i've got to be in the mood to wear that and like i don't really know and i'm going to a gig and i don't really want to be like whoa fluorescent but that could be a vibe this neon sweater which was 15.99 and this satin skirt so we will see that is outfit option number one uh i also got two really cool jackets from the sale i'm not sure if i managed to film it or not because it's always like super awkward filming in stores in public i do it anyway because i generally just don't give a damn but it's a bit orcs so i got this leather jacket which was 18 pounds 18 pounds in the sale and i think it's actually freaking cool like it's really soft and i like it so i'm just gonna try it on for you now so i thought this could potentially be a vibe with the um black satin skirt if i want to go like oh i don't know bike a girl on you and have a bit more of a cool cool vibe going on depends on the weather also but yeah it kind of does up like this and it's all like pretty cool so i like it so this with the black satin skirt all black which again is not that me so i don't really know why i got it but i'm thinking mm, going to a gig black is a safe bet so that's two outfit options i have going for me but you can tell i really freaking liked this um leather jacket because yeah i went there i went there i got it in white too but the white's my favorite to be fair like i was originally just gonna get the white because i saw it and i was like oh, this is so cool but then i was like but what if i'm going for the black vibe like what do i do so i got both because they were in the sale and you know, I'm unnecessarily like that and I have no self-control, so... But I'm not mad about it because I really like it, so... This could potentially also go with the lilac skirt if I choose that one. Not sure it'll go with neon, I don't know. I also got some jeans just in case I don't fancy wearing a skirt, but you know what, I was like why don't you just go for it olivia like step out of your comfort zone put on a skirt just roll with it go on a night out in a skirt like what's the worst that could happen your legs get a bit cold maybe i'll even do makeup should i put some makeup on oh my freaking god am i gonna put makeup on maybe i'll put makeup on. should i do a makeup routine that's gonna be the worst thing ever. I own like two pieces of makeup. But anyway, we're gonna do a makeup routine later because I think that's fun. So catch you later when I finally decide to get ready like five minutes before I have to leave. So see ya. so like i said earlier i'm going to attempt to show you how i do my makeup and when i say attempt please please like label on the attempt because i am really not a makeup person and i have no idea what i'm doing so take this with a pinch of salt and basically don't copy me because i am rubbish but basically i don't put anything on my skin i don't know why i just never do and i feel like i will like turn out looking like an orange oompa loompa so i just leave my skin just as my skin so that part is easy and then i own four pieces of makeup equipment so three pieces of makeup one piece of equipment don't even freaking know why i have this i've used it like twice in my life but apparently you're supposed to so love that uh i have a blue mascara 
don't own a black one, don't know why, only own a blue one because I hardly ever wear it and I like blue and I like it. So yeah, basically that's it. And then I have, wait, these are the same. So basically I only have two products. These are an eyebrow, eyebrow brush thing, which I'll show you how I do it in like a second. But first off, we start with this curly thing there's a mirror here by the way so i'm not just like looking at nothing like i'm not that magical and i certainly cannot do it without a mirror because these things freaking scare me why do girls put these freaking things on their eyes they really scare me and i feel like i'm gonna rip my eyelashes out like every time i literally have nightmares about it Not to mention what an idiot you look. But yeah, this is what we're supposed to do apparently. So this is what I'm going to do in my little makeup routine that absolutely nobody wants to see. But I'm doing it anyway because it's a vlog. And I need content, yo. And so yeah, I'm just now putting on blue mascara because it's a vibe. It's not really, but if it, if it like kicks off and everyone starts wearing blue mascara then you can um credit me for starting the trend you know um but yeah i look so totally different not you know fun fact i've literally never worn black mascara like in my life ever like I think because I'm so fair, if I wore black, I'm like, I feel like I have like really big eyes. So if I wear black mascara, it's like way too much. Like, oh my God, I cannot wear eyeliner. If I wear eyeliner, I literally freaking look like a slow loris. My eyes are that big on my face. That's the story behind why I only have a blue mascara. I always get it on the eyelid. I always get it under my eye. Like, I literally can't even do it, but as best as i'm gonna get so you know this is me making an effort and what's the time half six so i have not very long I haven't even decided what i'm gonna wear yet but you know it's all gonna be okay because this is my eyebrow brush it's literally like a mascara i've been doing this for literally like three years i don't even know why it's just my thing i just always always brush my eyebrows up I just brush it up like this and again I, I just like I don't know why I do it it's just it's just my thing so that's the difference between one and two I don't know it just I swear it just like opens my face up a bit like literally I'm gonna stop saying like trying to justify why I do it because I don't really know why I do it and you know I am so low maintenance that this is literally it don't have a foggiest where I put highlighter, no idea. Foundation, don't want to look like an Oompa Loompa, so there was nothing else to do. So, other than eyebrows and eyelashes and perfume, so I don't stink out the room. And this is my makeup done. Yeah, that's it. So, I will show you my outfit when I've decided. See you later. I am just waiting for Polina. I am dressed. Don't laugh at my outfit. Do not laugh at my outfit, but I'm going a bit out there. I don't even care right now. Don't care. This is this is Polina. The lighting is so bad. But yeah, this is our outfit. And now we have to shoot. Okay, but are you seriously embarrassed by what I'm wearing? No, I mean look at I me. Said I'm too much. I mean I no, but I'm wearing like a, I look like a Benicia beacon, but <laughs> are you excited? Yes. Yeah. I'm excited. <laughs> so this is my outfit. Yeah, I went there. I went all out there for the literal neon and lilac and converse. And it's so windy. But this is what I'm wearing to the gig. So I like it on the bird. <laughs> we are done shooting and just waiting for Mr. Taxi Man now. As well. Oh wait, done. no, <laughs> I'm done shooting. Um, and you did see my outfit. So now I'm gonna shoot this lovely one and then we get our taxi. So we have like 10 minutes. So catch you when we see who's, wait, what was, <laughs> what's the blank called again? Who's eating grandma? No. I <laughs> forgot what it's called. I totally forgot what it's called. <laughs> Okay. 
straight to pit stop to top shop because I really need the loo and I know they will not have a toilet at the gig so we're in top shop. My bladder has failed me. Quick pit stop in top shop for some very proper granola. Oh my god, I didn't bring my invitation. I was like, they're not gonna let me in. Yes, they are. Yeah, they are here. Are you excited? Oh I, yeah, I'm vlogging it. Are you? And I went all out there with you the look meal. So cool. Hey. So yeah, this is lovely from Mercer. So.